protesters have gathered at a Safeway in San Francisco in the Castro. They're trying to prevent a recycling center from closing. Crowd Force Mike Pelton is there live telling us what's going on. Mike? Well, and Daria, this is one of those centers where you could exchange recyclables for money, but the argument really boiled down to was it becoming too much of a nuisance or was it a good source of income? In either case, the center is closed this morning. That's why you see a few dozen protesters out here led by the group, the Coalition on Homelessness. Now, this recycling center here along Market Street uh, operates under the nonprofit group Community Recyclers, but it sits on land that belongs to Safeway, who issued an eviction notice after complaints from critics poured in, citing noise and too many problems with people carrying around big bags of bottles. Now, that eviction was supposed to go into effect at the beginning of the month, but these protesters admit the nonprofit ignored the eviction order and operated until yesterday when they got the word the sheriff's office could force that eviction today. Now, the closure of the center and subsequent loss of income is a devastating blow, so say these protesters. A lot of people are either, if they're homeless, then they don't have rent, right? If you're on a fixed income, that's going to barely cover your rent. And so the, those are the folks who are going to have the sort of most negative impacts. Other people, recycling is going to be much more inaccessible, much more inconvenient. It's going to require a lot more work on their part. And back out here live, we are reaching out to both Safeway and the Sheriff's Department for comment this morning. At this point, it's unclear when or if authorities might arrive to force this eviction. But these protesters, Daria, tell me they are willing to risk arrest to send a message this morning. Of course, this is something we'll keep an eye on over the next few hours. Daria. All right. Thanks a lot, Mike.